What's up guys today's video is on the top 10 best gaming TVs, 2022, through extensive research and testing I've put together a list of options that'll meet we needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price performance or it's particular use we've got you covered for more information on the products. I've included links in the description box down below which are updated for the best prices. Like the video comment and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. 10th place. LG OLED C2. During our testing, we couldn't help but fall in love with the LG C2, a feature-packed, high-end 4K OLED with innovative brightness boosting technology and a full fist of gaming compatibility. It's undoubtedly one of the greatest gaming TVs of 2022, but don't expect it to completely replace the C1. The Alpha 9 Gen 5 CPU is at the core of the C2. This is what drives the set's brightness boosting technology, which employs algorithms to improve HDR handling by enhancing the brightest regions of a picture in real time. The end product is a significant upgrade over last year's C1 model. We found the overall image quality to be excellent, with excellent clarity, no banding, and fantastic shadow detail. The TV has a sleek new aesthetic design that should please fashionistas, and we adore LG's cosmetic tweaks, the bezel is nearly non-existent, and the panel rests on a more traditional center pedestal, reducing the need for large AV equipment. In terms of internal changes, WebOS 22 is a very well-equipped smart platform that comes with all major streaming services, including Netflix, Prime Video, Disney+, and Apple TV. When combined with LG's own ThinQ AI platform, it's also compatible with Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa smart devices for voice control of inputs and channels, as well as content search. The LG C2 will serve you well in bright room viewing situations while still looking realistically cinematic when the lights are dimmed. Our advice is to become familiar with the offered picture presets, cinema home and natural are the best for most content, and image interpolation settings, cinematic movement is ideal for films and TV drama. Ninth place. LG OLED G1. The LG G1 is still a quality screen from LG, despite being surpassed by this year's G2. It's still one of the greatest gaming TVs money can buy, and it's an OLED beauty with a near-perfect balance of premium design and cutting-edge gaming capabilities. However, its design isn't for everyone, the G1 is only intended for wall hanging, and it doesn't even come with feet or a pedestal unless you pay extra for them. But if you can get over it, you're in for a real treat. The LG G1 is the first OLED to feature LG's new Evo panel. Designed to provide brighter HDR performance, it definitely delivers on this promise. The G1 provides the greatest HDR performance we've seen from LG in testing. When combined with the brand's newest 4th Gen Alpha 9 image processor and a slew of AI picture improvement algorithms, the result is a gorgeous image with excellent detail and motion handling. The connectivity is also impressive. All four HDMI inputs are V2.1 and capable of 4K 120Hz games. Ohm, Auto Low Latency Mode, VRR, Variable Refresh Rate, VRR G-Sync, and VRR AMD FreeSync are also supported by the G1. Finally, LG has updated its menus for 2021, including a new game optimizer interface that allows in-depth tuning, including game genre selection based on game style. This 4K TV for gaming has really impressed us, and it's an excellent choice. 8th place, Sony X90J. The X90J is the most significant improvement to Sony's mid-range 4K HDR lineup in years. The business has been treading water and has been especially hesitant to push out the type of high frame rate HDMI capability that next generation gamers have demanded. The X90J sets out to change that, and it succeeds. Two of its four HDMI connections support 4K 120fps, so you'll be okay with any of the new gen consoles, but the TV will automatically optimize image characteristics for PlayStation 5 HDR, and will recognize if the PS5 is playing video material or a game, which we thought was really cool. Picture quality is exceptional in testing, due in large part to Sony's new Cognitive XR processor. This takes a different approach to image processing than competitors, aiming to mimic how people view items in real life by focusing on natural focal areas in the image. The screen is split into zones, and AI is used to establish where the focal point in the image is. It then focuses its image processing on specific areas of the image. The sole feature-related drawback is that we have yet to get the anticipated firmware upgrade that would allow VRR, variable refresh rate. The X90J has a full array local dimming backlight technology, which proved to be accurate enough in our tests to produce deep blacks and plenty of dimensional shadow detail. Dolby Vision is also supported, but not HDR10+. Nonetheless, it merits IMAX enhanced certification, which can't be awful. The Cognitive Processor XR can also handle audio, 
analyzing the sound location within a feed to match what's on the screen and up converting as needed. This works well with Sony's acoustic multi-audio system, and the speaker drivers have been strategically arranged around the minimum frame, resulting in a broader, more engaging soundscape. Overall, we consider the X90J to be a winner and an especially solid pick as the best gaming TV for PS5 users. 7th place. LG G2. The LG G2 is a 4K flagship OLED TV with an artistic flair. It has been given the greatest panel technology available from LG Display, as well as an artistic hang-on-the-wall design, no pedestal for furniture mounting supplied. And it's a bold claim to make as one of the greatest gaming TVs money can buy. Significantly, it provides the finest image performance we've seen from LG to far, thanks to brightness-boosting technology and a powerful Alpha 9 Gen 5 CPU capable of optimizing picture brightness and HDR performance. The G2 really glows here, with swathes of white having a wonderful brilliance and contrasty HDR peak sparkling on the screen. The processor of the Alpha 9 Gen 5 is incredibly powerful. It works well with native 4K resolution and use deep learning to improve HD upscaling by identifying genre and scene information to influence interpolation. There's also AI object enhancement, which can make foreground and background elements appear more distinct from one another, giving images a greater sense of depth. There is Dolby Vision IQ, HDR10, and HLG compatibility, as well as GIG, the HDR gaming standard. Sixth place. Samsung S95B. This first QD OLED from Samsung is stunning in every way, from its glorious slimness to its class-leading brightness. The panel combines typical OLED black levels with the high peak brightness and increased color volume of Quantum Dot technology, making it an excellent choice if you want to watch TV in a setting with a lot of light. All four HDMI inputs are V2.1 and handle 4K 120fps sources, while VRR, variable refresh rate, with NVIDIA and AMD FreeSync compatibility, as well as Ulm, are included, auto low latency mode. In addition, Samsung features a specialized game hub interface. In game mode, input lag is modest, we tested it at 9.6 milliseconds, 108060. HDMI 3 also has eARC, which may be used with a Dolby Atmos soundbar. In addition to this HDMI quartet, there are three USB ports, a digital optical audio output, Ethernet, and wireless connectivity options including Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, so you're fully provided for regardless of your arrangement. Samsung's Tizen is the smart platform of choice here. It supports a broad range of streaming services, for example, Netflix, Prime Video, Disney+, Plus, Apple TV+, and BBC iPlayer, as well as Samsung's own TV Plus IP-delivered channel service. It also works with SmartThings-enabled devices. Of course, the S95B's main selling point is its QD OLED display and accompanying neural quantum processor. The latter manages sound and visual using AI-driven optimization, so you don't have to think about it too much. The visual quality is outstanding. The degree of detail is superb, and the HDR performance is outstanding. Peak HDR brightness was found to be in excess of 1,400 nits. Unfortunately, there is no Dolby Vision support, although there is HLG, HDR10, and HDR10 Plus compatibility. It's not only the peak HDR brightness that shines, the set's average image level is also high, which makes it simple to watch in bright settings but can make for a tiring watch. It's not subtle, and even the game mode is overdone. On the positive side, playback at 4K 120fps is buttery smooth. Overall, the Samsung S95B is an extremely remarkable QD OLED debut. It has a fantastic peak brightness and a lot of color depth. It never looks very theatrical, and images often appear oversaturated even in game mode. Some may like the presentation, and it's a fantastic gaming TV that might pave the way for a new segment of the best gaming TV market to emerge in the future. 5th place. LG CX OLED, beyond the 2021 models of gaming TV, it's evident that those from 2020 are still worth a look if you're searching for a steal on a gaming TV. Even if you already own a PS5 or Xbox Series 10, the LG CX OLED TVs are the ultimate next-gen alternative, with an amazing 4K display operating at a blisteringly fast 120Hz. It's also great for PC gaming, owing to NVIDIA G-Sync support. That 120Hz refresh rate is ideal for fast-paced 4K gaming, such as first-person shooters and racing games, since LG's class-leading TV eliminates screen tearing. And, as one would expect from OLED technology, the black levels are excellent, and LG has really nailed this with a design that sees the CX line totally turn off individual pixels for the darkest settings. So, if you're bored of black scenes that appear to be really dark grey, this is the gaming TV for you. 
we're used to seeing most OLED TVs priced out of reach for a wide range of consumers, but the LG CX Olds are shockingly reasonable given the accolades they've received throughout the world since their introduction. The 65-inch opens a new tab, is fantastic, but we believe the 55-inch model hits the sweet spot of value and size for most households. Without a doubt, the greatest 4K TV for gaming money can buy right now. Fourth place, Sony A80J. The A80J is one of Sony's surprising hits, falling into the second tier of their OLED line, but don't let that mislead you, as the A80J is one of the finest value Sony game TVs available right now, giving a wonderful blend of quality, functionality, and bang for your buck. The A80J is a high-end Sony game TV that has all of the necessities. It features four HDMI 2.1 connectors, two of which enable OLM and VRR for 4K 120Hz gaming. The gaming experience and performance on the A80J are outstanding because to the 120Hz refresh rate and low latency of less than 10 milliseconds. VRR has been included thanks to a software upgrade, although its execution isn't as flawless and smooth as it is on LG or Samsung TVs. In addition, unlike rivals, there is no separate game mode menu for fine-tuning the TV's game settings. Minor quibbles in the grand scheme of gaming televisions, as playing games on the screen is very fun, but worth mentioning. Sony's powerful cognitive processor XR powers the Sony A80J's excellent image quality in SDR and HDR. This implies that films are portrayed wonderfully in a cinematic film that is faithful to the director's aim. Deep inky blacks and vivid, dazzling highlights make full use of OLED's remarkable contrast. In addition to native 3D surround upscaling of any audio source entering into the TV, the A80J supports Dolby Atmos audio, and the screen can live scan the room to best calibrate the sound. Fancy. Third place. Samsung QN95A. The Samsung QN90A is an excellent choice for anyone searching for the greatest gaming TV that 2021 has to offer. We discovered that the QN90A offers deep blacks, fantastic quality, rich colors and contrasts, and perfect HDR management by developing its already brilliant QLED screen innovation. Simply said, the image quality is excellent, due to a powerful AI-powered Neo Quantum 4K processor, and its intelligent mode optimizes all sources, making it an easy screen to live with, whatever you watch or choose. The television comes with one of Samsung's One Connect boxes, which connects to the set through a fiber optic cable. While this is an additional box to consider, it does allow for four HDMI 2.1 connections, so anyone with a multi-gaming device setup will be well provided for. Tizen, Samsung's smart TV platform, provides smart connection, and a broad selection of apps are accessible including Netflix, Prime Video, Apple TV+, Disney+, and now, as well as all the regular catch-up TV services. We are also really thrilled about the new game bar function. This is a separate tweaks and adjustments interface that allows for extensive personalization and experimenting. In regular game mode, latency is relatively low, we measured input lag at 10.1 milliseconds, 1080 In terms of HDR, HDR10, HLG, and HDR10 Plus Adaptive are all supported, however there is no Dolby Vision compatibility, which is unfortunate but has no effect on the overall performance of the TV. Thanks to Samsung's OTS Plus sound technology, the TV's sound system has been significantly upgraded and improved. Overall, a gorgeous high-end 4K TV for gaming, and the Neo QLED QN90A is the very greatest 4K QLED screen Samsung manufactures. The greatest Samsung gaming TV in our opinion. Second place. Hisense A6G. Design is on point, with a narrow bezel and spaced out feet, and connectivity are plenty, with three HDMIs on the back. While there is no support for 4K 120Hz, we are in budget territory here, but each of these ports does support OLM, auto low latency mode, and VRR, variable refresh rate, as well as eARC. Also, Hisense promises an input latency of less than 20 milliseconds, while we measured it at 48.2 milliseconds, 1080 while testing in game mode. However, the overall image performance is good, especially for the price, with great fine detail and adequate dynamics. Dolby Vision is quite helpful, instantly illuminating the set with Dolby Vision shows. We discover that motion handling is also accomplished, 60 Hz MMC, motion estimation motion compensation, interpolation and a variety of strengths works well for regular TV and sports. The US version has Android TV with Chromecast, however the UK version includes Hisense's own Vida Smart platform, as well as Freeview Play, which translates to a strong variety of streaming and catch-up players. So it's a win-win situation all around, and this Hisense is certainly one of the top budget competitors for best gaming TV. First place. LG OLED C1. 
the C1 is almost undoubtedly the OLED screen that every Nugent gamer is longing after right now, and it is one of the greatest gaming TVs money can buy in our opinion. Period. It takes playing nearly as seriously as we do, with four 4K 120Hz capable HDMI connections and a dedicated game optimizer control panel, and it instantly provided us with a wonderful experience in testing. We discovered a terrific, premium image quality that leans more heavily on AI smarts than we've seen before, is excellent in both native 4K and upscaled HD, and shows games very attractively. This is an OLED to be admired, with deep blacks, bright colors, and nearly three-dimensional levels of detail. We also discovered that motion handling has been improved. If you like a sleek interpolated appearance, True Motion Smooth is still available but there's also a cinematic movement option that does something smart with frame merging to ensure that movies always seem filmic. It is effective. HDR performance is also excellent. The C1 supports Dolby Vision, HDR10, GIG, and HLG, but not HDR10+, which is a bit disappointing. The set is available in a variety of screen sizes, starting at 48 inches, albeit this offers no significant cost savings over the step-up 55-inch, and features a powerful new CPU. LG's 4th Gen Alpha 9 chipset. AI is also used in the music industry. AI Sound Pro enhances stereo and 5.1 audio, and also includes a Dolby Atmos decoder. There is a wide range of streaming options and catch-up support. The set features a full-screen display and the brand new LG WebOS V6.0 platform. Thank you for watching, and until next time, I hope to see you all in the next video. See you later guys.